Hello YouTube watchers and subscribers. Look at this. Yep, I'm all strapped up again today, ready to show you another unboxing. If you were observant and you watched my unboxing of the Hover Air X1 Pro Max, you would have seen there was a brown box that I used to put the drones on top of. And I did say I was gonna do an unboxing of whatever that was. I was going to unbox this bit of kit nearer to Black Friday, which is on the 29th of November, because I'm sure, because I got it on a deal, there will be a discount over the Black Friday period. Because I purchased this when they had a Prime Day discount for Prime members. And I got a discount of over 50 odd quid for this bit of kit I'm going to show you now. So I'd wait until Black Friday and maybe you'll get the same. Because I'm telling you something, once you see this, you're going to want one. Links will be in the description if you want to purchase it over the Black Friday period. So let's go, let's crack on and get this thing unboxed. <music> you've seen what it is it's a b-day yep one of the essentials in any home a nice b-day <laughs> but the thing with this one is it's a very very special b-day i've looked at b-days for a while i had one before which i've had for about six years or longer i should say <laughs> And it was quite bulky, it was quite, I mean, it did its job, as you know, cleanliness is next to godliness, as they say, and this is what you need in your house. <laughs> yeah, always have one of these, mate, good bit of kit. But I've always had one, and it was kind of wearing down. And uh, yep, yeah, it's used every day, <laughs> as you would do. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it started to show its uh, time. So I started looking around for a new B-Day. And in my research, I saw a lot of them were good, but just not what I wanted. They didn't have the features I wanted. And then suddenly on Amazon, surprise, surprise, this thing popped up and I looked at it and I said, wow, this thing ticks every box I was looking for. My B-Day before had a large control panel along here. I've thrown it away now and I'm going to show you why I've thrown it away. It's gone because this is the second one you're looking at, guys. I've got two of them. This one I've just unboxed for you guys to have a look, but I'm going to show you one already done. But hey, we'll get to that in a minute. Let's talk about this a little bit. The reason why I went for this one is because it didn't have the control box here. The box to do all your settings and whatever. A lot of them have the remote control, which is this thing, and they've got the side bit here with the box. But this one has the remote control, as you can see there, but also settings on the B-Day itself are this little twist button here. So small, 
It's wonderful. I thought that's exactly what I was looking for. Something small and not too bulky. It looks like a normal toilet seat. You wouldn't tell the difference if you didn't know. You'd have thought to yourself though, what's this big black piece there? Maybe you think it's a bit of um, a design feature, but it's not. I'm going to show you soon what that is and you're going to love it. But hey, also it came with a, a UK plug, which is great because a lot of these things come from China and or, or the EU and they've got a different plug. And the ones that do have this plug on it cost a damn penny because they're not cheap. This one, for the features it's got, is the best you will find. I'm telling you guys, you ain't going to find this with all these features at this price. That's why I'm getting it to you now, because you're going to love this. I'm telling you. Do you know why? Because I loved it and I'm a tech guy. And when I saw this, I went crazy because out of all the hundreds of these that I looked through, this one ticked every single box, including the remote. To you people who are very observant, I'm just going to show you this remote control. Yep. Have a look at it. I ain't going to say nothing, but I'm going to show you something. So I'm going to block this off now. That's it. That's all you got. And now I'm going to show you the actual B-Day working. So I'm going to put this back in the box because this is for the second toilet. And the second toilet needs a little bit of work when it comes to electricity because obviously these things you need to plug them in and if you haven't got an electrical outlet in your bathroom or in your toilet you've got to find one that's the only problem you've got to get an electrical socket somehow yeah so the second toilet we've got or the bathroom hasn't got a three pin socket in it so I've got to sort that out but the toilet downstairs has and I'm going to show you guys exactly why this is so special. Let's have a look, let's go. It's an automatic opening and closing lid. That's what's so special about this one, guys. <laughs> Unbelievable, isn't it? You thought it was gonna be a normal lid, didn't it? You gotta use your hands to open it like this. None of that stuff there, guys. This is an automatic opening and closing toilet lid. And as you can see there, it's also got a seated body sensor and the reason for that is this gets nice and toasty so in the winter months which is coming quick and fast you're going to have a nice toasty seat when you're sitting down relaxing also there's the remote control guys it's on the wall so when you're seated obviously you can just tap what you need to tap there and that black bar that was at the back, guys, have a look at that. That's a view of your settings. You can see that's 34 degrees for the temperature of the seat. That's a picture of the seat, and that's the temperature of the seat, a nice toasty 34 degrees. And that can all be changed from the remote control here guys you can change all the settings here here's another one that you're gonna like and I'm gonna press it from the remote control have a look at this <laughs> you're gonna love this let me get it in shot <laughs> look at that guys you're gonna love that but look at this I've closed everything up now, when you're ready to clean it, etc., watch this. <laughs> I 
I know you love that. You must be going, I want one of those. That is awesome. And it is. If I just want to close the seat, I've actually got the remote here, guys. I've taken it from the wall, because all it is is a slide thing. It just slides on here like that. But if you just want to pick it up for whatever reason, like what I'm doing, I've picked it up and I'm just using it like this. And then I could do what I want. Watch this, guys. This is just the seat. Watch this. Oh. Oh, 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 you can't beat that, can you? You cannot beat that. And then the cover. <laughs> you don't have to touch a thing, guys. You don't have to touch it. Just as you walk up to it, watch this, I'm gonna walk up to it. Supposing I'm gonna sit down and the lid just opens up. That gets nice and toasty for me. And I just take my seat on the throne and chill. Wonderful bit of kit. The only problem I've got, as I'll show you here guys, is the shape of my to toilet itself. It's just a small downstairs toilet. It's not a big one, it's just something in the thing. But because of the shape, obviously it's not the correct shape of the bowl inside. So the seat is just a little bit off as far as being the exact shape of the toilet bowl. But take your measurements, guys, check your toilets, and I'm sure it will fit if yours is a different size to this. As I said, this toilet is the, one of the smaller ones, very, very small. It's not big at all. So if it was a larger toilet bowl, it would work fine. It would be fine and the shape would, it's an elongated shape as you can see there, like a D, D shape, it's not a round shape, it's a D shape. So it will fit any D shaped toilet, I think, elongated toilet. And uh, yeah, you're good to go. I'll just run through some of the settings. At the top here's the cover, as we've seen already. And you've seen it numerous times because I love pressing it. That's the cover. Oh, and I forgot to tell you as well, once it's up, once you've gone and done your job, it will automatically close the lid. If the lid's up, once you've done your thing, it will go back down. So when you come in here the next time, this is how you will view it like this, because it will just automatically go down after a set amount of minutes. And then when you walk into the toilet, it sees you, the sensor picks you up and it opens it up automatically. As you can see here, as I walk to it, it automatically comes up. So that's really good. I don't have to touch it or press the button here, the cover button to close it at all. You just do your thing, wash your hands, off you go, and it will close auto, you know, automatically. It will close automatically. So that's really good. Again, that's the C, as we know. That's the pressure, guys. You can regulate the pressure of the water that comes from the B-Day itself, that's really good. That's to position, you can position, I can't show you guys, because obviously the water's gonna splash all over the place. So you just gotta take my word for it, it does work. That's to position, you can position the B-Day um, spout to different positions. This is what you would use, that button you'd press that to actually start everything working. You press it once, the spout comes out, starts washing and then you press it again and it moves it moves back and forward can you believe it guys that's really good it does work it actually moves you can feel it going back and forward back and forward unbelievable it is definitely the best this bit here that's for women obviously the female it's got a dryer you can press that and you can change the heat settings for the dryer so if it's too hot for you you know, too hot for you, you can turn it down. That's auto, that does everything automatically. It comes on for a certain amount of time and the dryer comes on for a certain amount of time and then it all switches off. You can adjust the water temperature, guys, look at that. 
My other one didn't have, no, it did have that, tell you the truth. Yeah, you can, most bidets do, yeah, because it could be cold water, you don't want it too cold, innit? You know, so you need to be able to regulate the temperature. So that's the water temperature you can regulate. The air temperature, if it's too hot or too cold, you can turn that up or turn it off. With all these guys, you can turn it off. There's a setting that just leaves it as it is. If you didn't want the air temp or the dryer, you can turn it off altogether. That's the seat temperature, which I showed you earlier, with the auto sensing seat. You can set that to what temperature you like. And there's a light inside, a UV light. Not any old light, guys, a UV light. And you know what that does? That is for bacteria. It, UV light's obviously what's used to get rid of bacteria and things like that. So that comes on every time you use the B-Day. Not many B-Days have got that, guys. They don't have a UV light, I tell you that. And this is the clean button. After a while, although I must say, every time it's being used, it cleans. So once you sit down, it goes through an automatic cleaning cycle. So it's always fresh for someone that's using it. It doesn't stay as it is, yeah? So that's really, really good. This clean button is only if you want to give it a clean yourself, yeah? But it always does it for every new person. It cleans the spout, our arm. It always gets cleaned, which is good. And that's the stop button. So once you've pressed any of these, yeah, whatever you want to press, like these three, if you press any of those, it will stay on until you stop it. So you press the stop button and it will stop when you feel that it's done its job. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah, guys, as you can see, the light's gone off. Oh, it's come up, see, it saw me there and everything comes alive. Can you see the UV light there? It's a little, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. What am I doing? Let me turn this off. There it is, guys. You can see it nice and clearly now. There is the blue UV light shining in the bowl. Let me close the door because it's getting a bit dark now. It's getting dark in the UK. Do you know what time it is? 15.51. Nine minutes to four and it's getting dark. Oh, God, I hate this weather. But hey, what can I do about it? I need to get on another holiday, that's what I need to do. But yeah, as you can see guys, there's the blue light, shining bright. Oh, it's always oh, an absolute one. I know you love this, because I do. You can hear the excitement in my voice. I absolutely love it. I just go to the toilet to use it, even if I don't want to go. <laughs> Let's close it all. Oh, I forgot to show you before I go. There is the side controls of the b day there so if you want to do it yourself like if the remote control batteries were dead etc you can do it oh here it is it's washing <laughs> it thinks someone's coming to sit down on it and it's coming out oh look at that that's cool that's the arm that's the spout coming out guys being washed i'm glad i caught that <laughs> i thought i'd have to sit on it to get that to work but it's working without me doing anything. Oh, you know what I could have done? Press the clean button, innit? I just showed you. <laughs> but that's what it's doing, guys. It's cleaning the spout, getting any residue, etc., that you, that might be on there, off it before you use it. So yeah, that's it being cleaned, guys. That's it, now it's switched off. And then it goes back into its little space there. And as you can see, it's cleaning everything keeping it nice and fresh. I told you guys, this is the best one I've seen. The good thing as well, it's using fresh water as well. As you can see there, I put the, oh, there's two in the box. That's the water filter, the B-Day with a water filter. <laughs> that's so good, isn't it? And then that's the pipe that goes to the B-Day, goes to the water filter, and then obviously to the toilet pipe work. And then there's me plugged there that I've got it plugged in. It's got a safety cutout switch there, obviously. All these things always have a safety cutout switch because it's water you're dealing with. So you've got to have that if there's any water detection that'll just switch off automatically. And that's it, guys. That is it. What a great bit of kit. 
Whew, I'm puffed out now because I was so excited. <laughs> I was so excited to show you guys this that it's taking me breath away. Yeah, guys, I hope you like it. As I said to you before, I got this on Amazon Prime Day deal and I got this for 235 quid. I just checked for you. It's on Amazon now for 290 quid. But if you wait until Black Friday, I'm sure they're gonna drop the prices because they did for the Amazon day. So, check it out, hope you like it, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Catch you later.